trigonometry is used for the study of periodic phenomena. What do we mean by periodic? For now, we'll content ourselves with an informal definition. A graph is periodic if it is the same shape repeated over and over again. So, for example, we might to look at to the water line. We might look at the height of the ocean at a pier. Tides go up, tides go down. As the tides go up and the tides go down, the water line increases and decreases. So you see it's the same basic shape repeated over and over and over. And you see periodic phenomena a lot in real world situations. Let's give a completely different example that will still have a similar looking graph. In the second example, we are going to look at a bio reactor in which yeast cells are being maintained. And we're going to look at the amount of carbon in the bioreactor. And what we see is this. Yeast cells use carbon to replicate. A lot of yeast cells replicate at once. The amount of carbon goes down. The carbon gets used up. The carbon replenishes. A bunch of yeast cells replicate at the same time, the carbon gets used up again. The carbon replenishes, the carbon gets used up again. So it's a completely different situation from looking at tides but we see the same type of thing, the same shape repeated over and over. A significant motivating factor of trigonometry is as a tool for studying periodic behavior.